OpenAI is the leader in the field of artificial intelligence and machine learning. Their recently introduced chatbot, ChatGPT, hit 1 million users in just 5 days and it is already rumored that the next generation chatbot, ChatGPT4, will arrive in 2023 and could potentially be 10 times more powerful. But what does this mean for the world of work and various industries? How will ChatGPT change the way we work and communicate? People are already predicting that chatbots will eliminate all sorts of jobs, but also create new ones and will ultimately start a revolution as profound as electricity, fire or the internet. So in this video, we'll be taking a closer look at five different industries and we'll explore how ChatGPT could potentially transform the way they operate. So are people unnecessarily panicking over AI or are we really about to experience a significant revolution? This is what we will discuss in this video and so without further ado, let's find out. All right, hi there, my name is René Zellman and before I start sharing my thoughts, I would love to know what you think. Which industries, which sectors and jobs do you think will be fundamentally transformed by AI, so artificial intelligence and chatbots? Which jobs will become obsolete and what advice would you give your children when it comes to choosing the right career path during the era of AI? And when will these sectors be affected? Immediately, within five to 10 years or within 20 years? Now, obviously, I don't have a crystal ball, but personally, I think AI will affect all sorts of industries and some of these changes will happen pretty much immediately. So what I will do in this video is I will focus on the industries that will feel the impact of AI and chatbots right away or over the course of the next couple of years. Okay, so first of all, I think artificial intelligence is going to fundamentally change various creative industries. While it might take a human many hours or days to write the script for the opening scene of a horror movie in which artificial intelligence plans to take over the world. A chatbot like ChatGPT can do exactly that within seconds. Similarly, I could ask the ChatGPT chatbot to write a script for the introduction of this very video. If I had to guess, I would say that it took me around half an hour to come up with the right words for the introduction myself. And as you just saw, the introductory words chosen by the chatbot are perfectly fine as well. Now, a similar benefit could help accelerate the creative processes in the literature industry when it comes to writing poems or novels, in the music industry when it comes to composing beautiful lyrics, or in the gaming industry when it comes to developing mind-blowing characters, creating locations or entirely new worlds, or when it comes to coming up with unique new concepts. And obviously not only AI chatbots can be a major game changer here, but AI image generators like Midjourney or Dell E can also be of tremendous help when it comes to visualizing ideas. For example, I'm sure I'll use some of these image generators for the creation of thumbnails for some of my future videos. And what's important to understand is that in the near term, these AI tools are simply that tools. They are not a replacement for the creators, artists, visual designers, writers or poets, but they can assist them in their work, make recommendations for changes, maybe analyze data or yeah, simply accelerate their work and overall increase the productivity yeah, of each individual. Or AI could create completely new artistic style and potentially lead to the creation of entirely new forms of art. Next, the content marketing industry could be completely overhauled by AI. Current chatbot iterations can already be used to write clickbaity headlines or YouTube video titles to distribute the content to various platforms or to simply optimize content for retention. For example, content marketers could use chatbots to turn longer blog posts or video scripts into a handful of individual tweets or Facebook or Instagram posts. And similarly, one could ask a chatbot to make the video scripts more intriguing to make sure that, yeah, the script really catches the viewers or the reader's attention. Future iterations of chatbots will then likely be able to analyze individual users' data and can therefore help advertisers and brands personalize their content, which can help to increase engagement and conversions. Now, the third sector that will be disrupted by chatbots and conversational AI is the education space. Students could, for example, just ask chatbots to solve mathematical problems, to write homework assignments on specific topics or answer exam-like questions. 
So essentially, students can now outsource processes such as writing, researching or calculating. And some academics are already suggesting that the clarity, thoroughness and accuracy of the responses provided by the ChatGPT chatbot may be the end of traditional educational assessment methods. For instance, ChatGPT already successfully passed a practice bar exam used by law schools, achieving an overall score of 70%. And similarly, Twitter user Albert Henry asked ChatGPT to answer questions used in the PLAB1 exam, an exam which is used in the UK to make sure doctors who qualified abroad have the right knowledge and skills to practice medicine in the UK. And here too, the results were quite surprising. Of course, in its current form, the ChatGPT chatbot is not 100% accurate and it will occasionally present false information as if the answer provided is correct but AI engines will eventually get close to 100% accuracy, which means that traditional school and education systems need to change. The way students learn, the way teachers teach, and the way students' skills are tested. For example, written assessments will need to prioritize critical thinking and reasoning, which chatbots like ChatGPT haven't quite mastered yet. You could certainly argue that conversational AI will have a positive impact as it can be used to give personalized support and create an individualized learning experience for each student. Students basically have their professor or a personal mentor readily available in their pocket, which can also be asked yeah, during hours outside of the typical class hours. Okay, fourthly, AI is already transforming the coding landscape. You can, for instance, ask ChatGPT in natural language to create entirely new lines of code. I'll show you a couple of examples on screen right now. Or developers could ask the large language model to find bugs in already existing lines of code. And even though the current chatbot by OpenAI is not flawless when it comes to creating new lines of code and it cannot create complex code yet, such as code that would be required for like a banking app, for example, that requires developers to tie together smaller parts of code to create yeah, more complex systems. It can still assist developers and over the long run, ChatGPT will likely make the development teams smaller and just like in the creative industry, coding processes may simply be accelerated and overall be less capital intense. All right, and then the last sector that I wanted to talk about in this video is relatively small, especially compared to the major industries that we have discussed so far. But I think AI will most certainly also simplify email marketing. Just like in the other sectors, it will most likely accelerate the work and possibly lead to more engaging yeah, email campaigns. You could, for example, simply ask ChatGPT to write a cold email to potential customers. We have not previously expressed an interest in your business in which you then introduce your personal training business and explain what you do and how you can help the customers. And again, future chatbot iterations may be able to access social media platforms, user data or other data sets and can then personalize emails, which in turn increases open rates and conversion rates. Now, as I said at the beginning of the video, nobody has a crystal ball and I might be wrong on some of these predictions, especially when you are trying to predict where AI will be in 10 years or more. I'm sure more insane things will be possible. You can probably generate hyper-realistic videos, for example, with avatars and yeah, I might, I might not even have to sit in front of a camera to create a video like this one. But with the most recent ChatGPT model, many AI capabilities are already here right now. And as I outlined, these developments are about to transform multiple industries over the next few years. 